Today, I will be showing you how to get the vicious quest on Area 51. And the first thing we're gonna have to do is we're going to have to go past spawn and we're going to have to talk to the wraith guy. Um, I don't know his specific name, but um, he's all the way back here. And as you can see here, there's a candy here. This is actually a fake candy. No candies will spawn if you um don't talk to him so just remember make sure you talk to him so we'll talk to him and so you can just say understood and the quest will start if you say what if i don't want to um he'll make this little scream and if you say i decline he will teleport you to endless into a wave 666 match where you have no points to open doors so i would just say i accept and once you go you're you're good to go um, of course, this is Vicious Wraith, so. so now the quest is started, let's show you off some spawns. So, um, for the candies, you have to find 10 candies, and 10, ca 10 candies out of the 25 total will spawn for you, and specifically you. If you rejoin a new server, those same 10 spots will be your spots forever. So the first spot is right here where MLG is standing, right near this Area 51 sign, right behind the truck. Now we're gonna show you the next spawn, which is on top of this roof. So you can climb the roof by going up here or going here. And the second spawn is right here. So this is the second spawn, a candy can spawn here. It didn't spawn for me, unfortunately. Now we're gonna just move our way over just to keep it really basic. Remember, you can just search however you'd like. You don't have to follow me, but I'm just gonna show you all of the spawns so you can get your candies. And look, we found our first candy, which is all the way up here and actually on top of this roof and of course you can just turn off shift block and then jump back up and so i got my first candy <clears throat> so very epic and let's go so now here's another thing if let's say dc here picks up a candy as well it'll actually total up to two for me too so actually um you can hunt with your friends and you can get the candy really fast if you both collect candies at once so just a cool thing. The next candy spot is the fourth one, and it's in this little invisible pumpkin. There are no candies that spawn in the solid pumpkins, as far as we know. And so one can spawn here. And now so the fifth spawn is right over here on top of this shelf, right here. This is the fifth spawn, and it's a pretty good spawn as well. Uh, it's one of the newer ones we didn't know about for a while. And then where Dr. Green is standing right here is the sixth spawn. Uh, for a candy. Remember, candies could spawn in both of these areas for you. Uh, and now the seventh spawn, which actually has a candy for me, right here in the medic room on this side. And then the eighth spawn is on this cactus. Yes, on this cactus, there might be a candy on top of here. Try not to die. Uh, it does hurt you. But yeah, a candy could be just be floating up here. It's kind of funny. Um, and so now we're going to go to our ninth spawn, which is where Dr. Green is standing right here. Um, there can be a spawn right here, which is awesome. Um, of course, this isn't really the best spot uh, because it's just kind of middle of nowhere. But at least you can see it from the jet area. And that's where we're going to go to next. We're going to be going toward the air hangar area as there are quite a few spawns in here. Okay, so this is the 10th spawn right here. Uh, it's right here-ish. Um, and it can spawn, the candy can spawn right here. The next spawn, we're going to be picking up the pace because, of course, we need to. Um, this is the 12th spawn right over here, or t 11th spawn right here, which is right in this corner, uh, right near the air hangar, right there. And now we're gonna grapple all the way, um, to the 12th spawn, which is all the way over here. Yeah, it goes pretty far. The, the 12th spawn kind of aligns with the second bar, and then it meets in the middle. So right here would be where the 12th candy could be for you. Now, it's a pretty far spawn. You don't have to check it. Uh, candies, I believe, do move every time you collect them. So, and you could theoretically never check that ever again. Also, you just saw another candy. Um, there are quite a few candies spawned over there for me. Uh, I'm going to show off as many spawns as I can. Uh, but before we show those, I'm going to go over here because there can be a spawn right here, which is the 13th spawn. And it can go in between this tower and this fence. Um, and the next spawn is underneath this little walk area, and it's right in this little corner, right where I'm standing, right here. Uh, a candy can spawn. This is the 14th spawn. Now we're going to move up, because the 15th spawn is here, and there is a candy waiting for me. That is where that spawn can be. 
uh, spawn for me, luckily. And the 16th spawn is actually in this truck. There can be a, actually a candy in this uh, back of this truck. And the next spawn is, we're going pretty fast, of course, um, is the 17th, which is right here for me. 17th spawn right here, which is pretty nice uh, in this room. And there's actually more. Um, there's actually an 18th spawn right here um, as well on top of this sector area. And then the 19th spawn's actually where Dr. Green is. So this spawn actually spawned for me, but he actually collected the candy. So that's why it didn't pop up on my screen, but he did collect it for me technically. And this is the 20th spawn right in this truck. Um, there are three spawns in the trucks, by the way. This is the second one. Um, and so now that has a lot of spawns um, and it is killing my voice, but it's all good. Um, so now we're going to the 21st spawn, which is right here. Uh, right on this orange truck, which is really nice, actually. And then the next spawn is the 22nd spawn. Right over here. And it's right here. Uh, right on under this truck. And then we have the 23rd spawn, which is right here. Uh, right in between this box. And then the 24th spawn is right here. Uh, under this tent. Uh, that could be a spawn. And the 25th spawn is right here. A candy actually spawned for me. And then the 26th and the 27th spawns are right over here. So, the 26th spawn is actually right here. It can actually spawn between this fence and this block. And then, of course, the 27th spawn is this last candy, which I actually have. Uh, which is right in the middle of this area. You don't need grapple or speed to get it. Luckily, but it does it is a jump that is hard to get. Alrighty, so unfortunately, um, the studio spots were released, so all of the spots have been confirmed. So if you go over here, uh, we did cover this spot where MOG is standing at, but yeah, we didn't cover this. So this could be spot technically spot 28. Um, and then we have two other spots um, that I never got to cover, unfortunately, we never saw. But at least we have the information now. This spot in the middle of the parking lot here. There's gonna be a candy that spawns here, number 29. And then of course, number 30 is on this tower at the top. Thanks to DC for finding this one and uh, bringing us back in the server. And yep, there's a spot right here, number 30. And that's all of the spots. Alrighty, so we're going to go talk to Evil Wraith now. And let's go see um, what he has to say. We got all the candies. Remember, this is a fake candy. So, uh, but I'm wondering what he's going to have to say to me. Um, hopefully, it's like one dialogue, but we'll see. Thank you for bringing me my candy. I've rewarded you with a special song you can enjoy in the main menu. Really interesting. And then we got the badge. So, those are all 10 of our candies. Thanks for watching, subscribe for more, and like the video to show support. I hope you enjoyed this guide, and I hope you see my reaction vid.